Item Number SCP-1373 Object Class Euclid Special Catan Procedures SCP-1373-A, SCP-1373-B, and SCP-1373-01-06 are to be stored in standard refrigerated containment for biological specimens. Requests for tissue samples from SCP-1373-01-06 must be made in writing to the current head researcher of SCP-1373. All researchers with Level 2 clearance or above are allowed access to SCP-1373-A and SCP-1373-B, which are not presently considered anomalous except by association. SCP-1373-07-16 are not currently contained. Mobile Task Force Theta-5, the bigger boat, is assigned to locate and capture these entities before they achieve sexual maturity and begin reproducing. All surface and subsurface vessels in the area are to be tracked, and periodically examined for unusual hull damage. Description. SCP-1373-01-06 are the carcasses of six newborn albino dusky sharks, Cartrahenus obscurus, recovered from the womb of a pregnant dusky shark, SCP-1373-A, caught off the coast of California on 2011. The mother shark was acquired by the Foundation upon reports that its pectoral fin bore a luminous and tattoo reading, Property of Dr. Wondertainment. A necropsy revealed the presence of SCP-1373-01-06, which were judged to be capable of surviving and were delivered live by Caesarean section. SCP-1373-01-06 are afflicted with cyclopic holoprosencephaly. Manipulation of each organism's dorsal fin caused the eye to emit laser light at a wavelength of nanometers. Experimentation revealed that the intensity of the laser can be adjusted with pressure on the fin, peaking at a maximum output of watts, with newtons of force applied. This is sufficient to burn through metal at close ranges of 50 to 100 centimeters. In the case of SCP-1373-01, this resulted in the cooking of the organism's rudimentary brain, causing its immediate death. SCP-1373-02 burned to death after it ignited the sclera of its own eye. SCP-1373-03 and-04 were sliced apart by SCP-1373-05's laser when-05 experienced a brainstem seizure, causing it to convulse spasmodically before dying, and-06 died of cardiac malformation. The mechanism by which SCP-1373 generates laser light is not fully understood. It is believed to use as a gain medium. Each organism's single eye was incapable of sight, instead being filled with a large amount of laser cells containing However, whether the cyclopia is an intentional modification or merely incidental is as yet undetermined. As is typical with organisms afflicted with hollow prosencephaly, the majority of the brain is absent, however, possibly intended as a replacement. SCP-1373-07-16 are the offspring of SCP-1373-B, a pregnant dusky shark captured on 2011, approximately 160 km east from the capture point of SCP-1373-A. When SCP-1373-B was brought on deck of the civilian fishing vessel, the ship's crew noticed weird lights coming from the shark's thoracic area. The precise sequence of the events that followed is unclear. However, three crew members were sliced to death by lasers, and another five were blinded. Subsequent examination of the carcass of SCP-1373-B indicated that it had been sliced open by lasers from the inside and revealed traces of no less than nine placental yolk sacs. A note was found inside the womb of SCP-1373-B with severe laser damage. Refer to document 1373-HG-41 for details. Hours of fun and laughter. These little fellows can… even in your school lunches. Warning. Changing batteries requires adult…